lot swell. Uh, in this video, um, I am going to create, um, I'm actually not going to be creating anything. I'm going to be attaching a network controller, or actually, let me go back. I'm going to connect a virtual switch um, to the network controller of the virtual machine. Um, so let me walk you through what that is. So right now I have a Windows 8 machine. It's in. Uh, it's actually running right now, and here it is. And as you can see, it uh, is not connected. So this is the default state uh, of a virtual machine. Um, so you first, you know, you create the virtual machine. Nice. You can, you know, load it up, install the the OS. You could, you know, you can fool around with it, but by default, there is no network connectivity, um, and that's when uh, we actually create a virtual switch for it. And after creating a virtual switch, it's still not enough for it to, you know, actually have connectivity. So you actually have to do something else. So what you need to do is you need to go into uh, the settings. Uh, there's two ways. You can click on the VM and go down here to settings or you can just right click on the VM and go to settings so either way it works go to the settings and if you go down you're gonna see network adapter and you can see that it's not connected so what you need to do is you need to click on it and from the virtual switch drop down um, you select the virtual switch that you created um, so definitely make sure you create a virtual switch first before attaching or trying to attach it to the network adapter uh, because you won't be able to since it wouldn't be here so select it um, my virtual switch is actually external virtual switch so what it does it's it connects to my physical um, NIC on this Windows 10 machine that I'm on it's a physical computer with a physical NIC and what you're allowing it to do is you're allowing the virtual machine to uh, use it so you're allocating that you know uh, that resource down to the VM level so I selected V switch one um, you can check off VLAN ID if um, somehow you are on a VLAN uh, your desktop is on a VLAN otherwise or, or server I should say um, but for the purpose of this lab it's not on a v there's no VLANs so I'm not gonna check that off and I am not going to um, uh, specify um, the bandwidth uh, which is a neat option I mean if you don't want the VMs to you know um, use up all the bandwidth um, if you want to limit that this this is where you would where you would do that so after you do that just uh, just apply okay and now if I go back to my VM BAM there's network access so if I go to the you know command line oops too many and if I just uh, you know ping 888 um, I get you know I get a reply and that's it that's how you attach a virtual switch to a network controller again thank you for watching